calibration. Open up the cover. Proceed to calibration with the connected sub boxes following our standard procedure. Present the yellow service key in power on mode. Confirm the calibration button by pressing PF2. Confirm the expiry date of the key. Press PF1 to select the adapted configuration for the Medica and the number of installed LC174 packs and then confirm this step with PF2. Confirm the internal reservoir of the Medica. Confirm the replacement reminder date of the DILC174. Confirm the composite vent filter LC136 replacement date. Confirm the UVLC105 replacement date. Confirm the replacement reminder date for the LC175 or the LC177. Confirm the replacement reminder date for the LC109. Confirm the RO sanitization, which should be set for every 28 days. Press PF1 to set the 0 mega ohms per centimeter value and confirm with PF2. Press PF1 to set the 1 mega ohm per centimeter value and then confirm with PF2. Set the 10 mega ohm per centimeter value with PF1 and confirm with PF2. Set the 18 mega ohm per centimeter value with PF1 and confirm with PF2. Press PF1 to set the 40 mega ohm per centimeter value and confirm with PF2. Set the sub 10 box onto 150 microsimmons per centimeter. Press PF1 to set the value and confirm with PF2. Adjust to the value of 5 microsimmons per centimeter by PF1 and confirm by PF2. Verify the 100 microsimmons per centimeter value and confirm with PF2. Set 1 degree on the sub 07 box. Adjust with PF1 and press PF2 to confirm. Adjust to 35 degrees Celsius with PF1 and confirm with PF2. Move the sub-07 from TH3 to TH4. Adjust to 1 degree Celsius with the PF1 key and press PF2 to confirm. Adjust to 35 degrees Celsius with PF1 and confirm with PF2. Confirm the reservoir level with PF2. Confirm the pressure in the recirculation loop with PF2. Confirm the non-activation of the transit mode with PF2. Adjust the PID settings on PF1. Adjust the PS1 set point to OX215. Press on PF1. Confirm the P gain on PF1. Confirm the I gain on PF1. Confirm the D gain on PF1. Confirm the PID limit on PF1. Confirm all the PID settings on PF2. Disconnect the sub-boxes and reconnect the corresponding line cells on the electronic board. Remove the sub-boxes. Close the top cover. Activate the DI reminder pack with PF1 and then press on PF2. Press PF1 to activate the replacement date for the LabPure DI pack and then press PF2 twice. Press PF1 to activate the replacement date for the composite vent filter LC136 and then press PF2 twice. Press PF1 to activate the replacement date for the UV lamp LC105 and then press PF2 twice. Activate the sanitization reminder with PF1 and then confirm with PF2. Activate the sanitization reminder by pressing PF1 then press PF2 twice. 